So you've got your battery. Yep. That's running. It's just the one motor that it runs then, is it? Yeah, so it's got a Danfoss AC current electric motor. So a battery requires a direct current to charge it. So we have an onboard charger up at the top here. So when we put our AC plug in, which would be one of these, which we, you know, sort of standard issue then in the electric vehicle world, that alternating current is di uh, converted to direct current to charge the battery. But we need to convert it back to AC to run the motor. Right. So AC motors are far more efficient and they can work in a, a much larger RPM band to a DC motor. Right. And hence why we've run with that on this, this Got machine. You. So that motor, that's sat down here somewhere, is it? So it would be where your sort of your, your engine meets your transmission on a right. normal tractor. Where yeah. your bell housing sort of would be, basically. Your bell housing, basically, yeah, yeah where, where, where your clutch would be on an old school tractor. Yeah. That's where that motor is. And then on the back of that motor, you've then got that reduction gear set to get the RPMs correct. Yeah. And then it's Fent Vario transmission. And then it's effectively, back from there, it is the same as It is the that same as this, this diesel brother over here.